Well, today we're going to make some clothespin puppets. So I have one here. And it says, hello there. Hello. And I have another one here. Going the opposite direction, a little different. We can talk to each other. So these puppets are pretty easy. They're made with a simple clothespin. I'm going to show you the back of this one. You see the back there? So there's a clothespin here. And this is just paper. And I have some ribbon glued on here. So what I did is I started with a cap. I can't remember what this is from. Jam maybe. And I put it on a paper. And I traced around it. turn this over. So here is the sample here so you can see I trace the circle and then what I did is I put a little bump for a nose and an eye and then I took a ruler and divided it in half. So it's easier probably than to work on your artwork to color this in before you cut it out. So I would color all that in. I used markers. Um, you can use crayons, you can use paint, you can use pencils, whatever you have. Once you've cut that out and you're going to cut right across that line, then you're going to take and you're going to glue onto, onto your clothespin. Now here's the thing, when you open it up, can you see where this metal bar is? You need to be careful to make sure that when you place your circle on it, that it doesn't get in the way of opening that up, okay? I used a glue gun to uh, glue my pieces on. You can use white glue or have a parent help you to glue those pieces on. So again, I'm gonna show you. I can open its mouth. You can turn it around so you can see how I did that. So you can play around, you can do all kinds of characters, you can do animals, you can do people, you can do whatever you want. Um, you can also not just do circles. So think about what kind of shape you might like to do and have some fun, create some fun puppets with clothespins. See you later.